If your attention span can make it through this very short video, you will know exactly how to create any character you want, and you will know exactly how to animate them to do whatever you want. Now, if that didn't convince you, I'm gonna spend another four hours editing this so you don't get bored and you can make it through this four minute video. We're gonna start by opening up Canva and searching for a monkey. We're gonna select photos and pick one we like. Then we're gonna hit edit photo and background remover and you can take however much time you want on this. Next, we're gonna head over to ChatGPT and ask it to generate us a monkey body. We do not want one like this, we want one more Disney looking. We're gonna save image as, and save it to our downloads. Next, we're gonna get rid of the background on this as well, and replace the monkey head. Flip the head as well, make it look a little bit better. And in this case, I'm actually going to make the eyes red. And then add a nice little red glow to that. So we're going to open up DaVinci Resolve and drag on our background and our monkey and the prison bars. And we're just going to resize these bars in the transform tab. Next hit effects, open effects, and then drag a Gaussian, a Gaussian blur. And just adjust that till it looks good and then do the same thing and put that on the background. Next, we're going to animate the bars. So on the first frame, you want to position the bar how you want it to start, and then press the keyframe on your timeline position where you want it to end, and then drag the bar down, and then we can just smooth that out in this line by pressing that little squiggly thing. And we have something that looks like this. Next, we're going to do the same thing with the monkey. So position the monkey where you want him to start, hit the keyframe, and then where you want him to end, and move that monkey up there. And then we're also going to smooth out the monkey's animation as well. Last step, we're going to go to effects, open effects, and drag the camera shake onto the monkey. Turn the PTR speed down, and turn the randomness scale to zero. This just gives the monkey a bit of a floating look to him. 